Hi everyone, now in this video I'm going to ask the question whether NASA, which stands for National Aeronautics and Space Agency, about how deceptive they are with some of the images they show us. Now, if you actually look into the credits for some of the pictures, like images taken by the Hubble Telescope, they are quite open about the fact that they are artist renditions. The artists are receiving like data in the form of numbers and from that making pictures. If you search deep enough into the images and the credits, you will see that. But I'm going to look at the pictures that they post on social media. Here we have one from NASA's social account. It shows the Earth with a picture of the Moon. Um, there's the astronaut Nick Haig, who is currently up on the International Space Station, supposedly, and is sharing what would appear to be pictures. Now, what I think is always interesting is taking one of these photos. I mean, here you can see they've got the moon in the background. Taking these photos and dropping them into a program. I use GIMP, but there's also Photoshop. Here we see the moon. Now, bear in mind, if these astronauts are really where they say they are, they shouldn't have a huge amount of problems taking pictures, legitimate pictures of the moon and so on, and the curve of the Earth. So why would they need to fake it? Now if we go to colours, take the saturation and increase the lightness a bit. And what you notice is that around the moon is this funny kind of box. Which would suggest that, well I'll take, I'll show you what a picture, a regular picture of the moon looks like. This is one I took from Bournemouth Beach. Uh, not the best picture, it was taken on my phone, so... But you can still see the moon. Now this is how it looks when we put a regular picture of the moon into programs and do the same sort of thing. We'll up the lightness. The picture gets lighter. But at no time do you see boxes appear around the moon. In fact we'll even mess with the hue. The saturation. Nothing. That moon stays exactly the, the same as you would expect it to. Now we have another picture from NASA. This one is shared from NASA's social website. Again a picture of the earth with the moon above it. Let's do the same process. Go to colours. Human saturation. Up the lightness. And what do you see? Yep, another box around the moon. Why? I don't get that. As I said, if these people are really where they claim they are in the International Space Station, surely they can take legitimate pictures without the need to add in images like this. I don't understand it. Well, any comments or questions you may have on this are always welcome, always appreciated. Please share them and I'll catch you again soon.